My name is Antonio Lain, and I'm the founder of CAVJS Labs. With CAVJS, your app supports collaborative multi-tenancy with minimal effort. Multi-tenancy is boring. Isolate customers, ensure a fair distribution of resources, and you are done. But adding the word collaborative changes everything. Bootstrap trust between users, help them to interact, this is the key to success for many, many apps. I'm going to show you a simple app that creates a Twitter-like experience for devices. Devices can listen to tweets with certain hashtags and respond to them. But we don't want anybody to trigger actions on our devices. Instead, we will configure policy to restrict it to a group of users. In the panel on the left, the user foo on my mobile phone will be sending a few tweets with the hashtag friends. In the panel on the right, you can see two Raspberry Pis. Device 4 has a buzzer, which makes an annoying sound, and device 3 has an LED that blinks with the events. Both are owned by user demo. They only receive instructions from the cloud and they could be anywhere in the world or have different owners. Let's look at how they are configured. Device 4 with the buzzer listens to tweets with hashtag CAVJS friends and allows Fu to send them. Device 3, with the LED, subscribes to the same hashtag, but ignores tweets from Fu. Fu tweets with hashtag KBS friends, delaying a couple of seconds an action that lasts one second. And as expected, we got the noise, but not the blink. Let's change the policy in device 3 to delegate to device 4. And now we do it again. And we've got the blink this time. With delegation, we can have a consistent policy for all our devices or get help from others to maintain a group. Also, the sound and the blink were synchronized. Actions are triggered with UTC time, not just based on when they arrive. And the client library helps to synchronize device clocks with the cloud. What this means is that we can synchronize actions on hundreds of thousands of devices across the world. We just need a couple of seconds of early warning to propagate these actions. And with some changes coming to the KVJS cloud, soon it will be millions. And the best part is that the backend of this app is only 154 lines of JavaScript. Four KVJS technologies are working behind the scenes. A trusted bus for authentication and authorization. Share maps to propagate groups. Publish subscribe for the hashtags. And time bundles to coordinate actions across devices. To learn more about these technologies, visit our website. The app is also in GitHub. Thanks for listening.